I'm noticing more and more of you having issues with your Galaxy Watch 4 faces. Some of you are getting messages saying they're not compatible, others can't even install them, and sometimes your watch faces are going missing altogether. So like the hero I am, I'm going to do a short video today to show you how to get around all of this. I'll also do a fresh install of a Galaxy Watch 4 face live on camera for you if you just don't know how to do it. Stay tuned. Hello everyone, welcome back to Tech It Easy. Leave a like on your way in. A super short Galaxy Watch 4 video today showing you exactly how to install your Galaxy Watch 4 faces. It's probably gonna be the shortest video I've ever made, but I feel like a lot of you needed this and not all of us are quite so technically adept and that is fine. So let's not waste any time, let's get straight into it. First things first, make sure you've done all the boring bits. Make sure all your software is up to date both on your phone and your Galaxy Watch 4 and restart both of them just for good measure. After that, the first method for getting your Galaxy Watch 4 faces onto your watch is actually to visit the Play Store on your desktop or laptop. Make sure you're signed into the same account as you use for your Galaxy Watch. Head to My Apps and if you have already purchased your watch face, you should see it in there. If not, you can also go to Account and then Order History and it should show up at the top. Click on the watch face you want to install, click install, then there will be a drop down box and you can select your Galaxy Watch 4 there and proceed. Wait a short while, make sure your Galaxy Watch 4 is connected to your phone and it should install the watch face for you. Now that was sort of the fix to the worst case scenario if you like. If you are just getting the message saying your device is not compatible, the workaround for this is just ignore it and install the watch face anyway. If you are worried about it actually not being compatible for your Galaxy Watch 4, you can always go to your account section and your order history like I just showed you and select request a refund. But nine times out of 10, the Galaxy Watch 4 phase will work on your watch even though it says device not compatible. Ignore all messages about your phone not being compatible, it really does not matter. Personally, I haven't had a single watch face that hasn't worked with my Galaxy Watch 4 in the end. I've just run into these issues where sometimes my watch faces go missing or they're just not installing and that was how you fix that issue. If you're still having issues after following those steps, there's one more thing you can try. You can try going to the Play Store through your Galaxy Watch or through the Galaxy Wearables app on your phone. If you're still having issues, then you're f now I'll quickly show you the normal way to install a Galaxy Watch 4 face. If you're struggling to find Galaxy Watch 4 faces, do check out my Galaxy Watch 4 face videos. There's plenty of different ones to try on there. Anyway, try and find a watch face that you like in the Play Store on your phone, then select install and it should just come up with the message and it should do it all for you. It's very, very simple. Then once it's downloaded, you can head over to your Galaxy Watch 4, press and hold on the Galaxy Watch 4 watch face screen, cycle to the left and it should be the first watch face there for you. If that didn't work for you, follow the steps I did at the start of the video and it should all be fine. So let me know if this video was helpful, did it rectify your problems or are you still having issues? If you are still having issues at this point, this would probably be the time to maybe ping Samsung a message and see if they can help you. But you should find that the methods I've shown you in this video will fix everything. So if the video was helpful, please do subscribe to the channel for more Galaxy Watch 4 content and to help me reach my goal of getting a silver play button by early next year. For now though, I've been Alex. This has been Tech It Easy. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.